Um, I think it's important because I think that there um, are not that many opportunities to interact with nature and there's a lot of an idea that we're kind of not part of nature and I think that we're all part of nature and especially in a city and in Brooklyn it's important for people to kind of feel like they're part of the whole. What do you think about littering in Flatbush? It's awful. <laughs> Too much garbage on the street. Um, I think we need some type of organization or boxes somewhere to help control it. Personally, I don't think I can help because I'm not out here throwing stuff in the street. <laughs> Maybe more garbage cans instead of on the corner, instead of on every corner or every other corner could help. Because a lot of people throw stuff on the street in the middle of the block. Um, what do you think we could do to keep Flatbush clean and beautiful? One, you have to educate the students in school about littering mm -hmm. and share the information in your homes. And when you see a driver throw something on the ground, if you have a chance, you could tell them to pick it up. have to walk through, especially when the wind is blowing. You don't want anything in your face or in your children's face. Well, today I'm going to be interviewing my mother about um, how she feels about Flatbush Beauty. You have to start from the beginning, like either grocery bags, um, recycling, you know, putting your garbage where it's supposed to be instead of dropping it on the floor because that gets into landfills, it gets into the water, and then that's how it starts pollution. Well, as a mother, um, I feel like pollution is not good, it's not healthy for the kids, especially if they want to go outside and play. Um, it could also cause asthma, it's, it's, it's an effect on the allergies too, how you have um, bad allergies. Well, we all work as a team to pick up all the soil and then dump them into the four baskets. And we made this more beautiful. 